Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here for another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to hopefully go about resolving if you're having an issue with the Windows Memory Diagnostic Tool that it detects that hardware problems were found. So this should hopefully be a pretty straightforward process here guys, and without further ado, let's go ahead and jump right into it. First thing I recommend doing would be if you had extra RAM sticks that were compatible lying around, I'd recommend swapping them out in your computer and see if that potentially resolves a problem. You may actually have physical hardware corruption, in which case a software fix is not going to be able to resolve the issue. So that's just one thing you want to take a look into. Something else we can try here as well is to run the hardware and devices troubleshooting utility. So if you want to open up the search menu and type in CMD, best match, you'll come back with a command prompt. Go ahead and right click on that and select run as administrator. If you receive a user account control prompt, you want to select yes. And now I will have a command in the description of my video. Go ahead and copy that and then go up to the top bar of the command prompt window here. Right click on it, select edit and paste that in. Hit enter. You can close out of the command prompt window at this time. Select the advanced button and make sure it's set to apply repairs automatically and then select next. If it gives you any suggestions, I'd recommend going ahead and enabling them or allowing them to proceed here. Okay, so once that's concluded, I'd recommend closing out of here and then restarting your computer. And at this point, hopefully your issue has been resolved. So, as always, thank you guys for watching this brief tutorial. I do about as well to help you out, and I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.